Ciao, I'm Victoria, your trusted realtor. And today I'm gonna to change your perspective on how you might think about home staging. When you hear home staging, you might be thinking expensive, expensive, expensive. Huge trucks moving in big furniture, totally disrupting your life. But it doesn't have to be that way. And in fact, it's not like that at all. Recently, I sold a home for $10,000, more than asking price in 11 days, and we had three offers. The home staging was transformative and it didn't cost a fortune. So now I'm gonna break it down and show you a few simple steps on how to get a house market ready with home staging. First, I'm gonna start with a kid's room. Now this room was adorable, but very cluttered. Believe me, my kid's rooms aren't perfect by any means either. No kid's rooms are. But when you're going to sell your house, you wanna put your best foot forward. So this one had a ton of stuffed animals all over the bed and it was just sort of messy, right? So in this room, we didn't really bring in any furniture. What we did was edit edit, edit. We made it look a lot cleaner, decluttered it, and just simplified it. So you can see here in the after photo, we removed all the stuffed animals from on top of the bed. We removed everything off of those cute little shelves above the bed. We opened up the curtains to let the light shine in, and we made the bed really nicely with all her cute pillows. We didn't bring anything in. All we did was take things out and depersonalize it to make it look a lot better. A few basics of home staging. Of course, we all know you need to take down any personal family photos, any religious artifacts that you may have. And essentially, you want to be able to neutralize the space so much that any buyer coming in will be able to see themselves and their family there. You also don't want it to be a distraction. So if you have all these collectibles, for example, sitting out, when a buyer comes and look at the house, they're gonna be distracted by all the cute little collectibles and they're not going to actually notice how amazing the room is or the light is coming in from the room or how the room flows. So it's super important just to depersonalize your space. Another rule of thumb is to take a third out of all of your closets. Remove the things that are from the past season. So we usually sell houses in the spring and summer, Get rid of all your winter stuff, pack them away, put them in the garage, stick them in the basement. You're moving. What you're doing is just packing ahead of time so that when a buyer opens up those closet doors, the closet looks way bigger when you don't have boots and coats and sweaters cluttering up that space. Another little tip is remove everything off of your counters. We don't want anything on your bathroom counters other than a little towel and hand soap. No toothbrushes, no hair, hair brushes, no makeup nothing remove it put it all away okay now we're going to take a look at the before and after of this living room mind you when you walk in the house you have a beautiful entrance and to the left the first thing that you would see is this living room a huge giant beautiful room but it was it was kind of a disaster i'm just going to say the carpet the area rug was not centered there was a bunch of family photos up on the wall there was a ladder sitting there because he was fixing something and it just it just didn't have any elegance to it the first thing we did was center the area rug we brought in some very tasteful neutral artwork quite a few pillows and then a coffee table you'll notice that it's very simple it's not busy what you want to do is showcase the home in that specific room and show its true potential here's a fun fact homes that are staged sell for 73% faster and anywhere between 10 and 20% more. Whenever I have my own sellers, I actually pay for the staging because I feel like it's so important. And then there are things that a home seller can do themselves that are super simple to help your house shine and look the best that it possibly can and sell a heck of a lot faster than an unstaged home. Thanks again for watching. I'd really appreciate it if you would like and subscribe. Ciao.